So step number six brings us underneath the truck to check out the entire steering assembly. Now you, what you want to do is a visual inspection. No, I'm not cheating by using the lift. You can do this on the garage floor. I just want you guys to be able to see what we're pointing out. Now first thing is every time you see one of these little zert fittings right here, hit it with grease until you fill up the seal. This way your ball joints will stay lubricated. Now when you move over here, you can see right away that this ball joint, the seal is split on it. What's going to happen is not only the grease going to come out, but the dirt's going to go in and that'll eat up that ball joint. So that's not a good thing. Now the biggest thing you see right here is this thing is soaked with some sort of fluid, whether it's oil or hydraulic fluid, you don't know, but we did a little bit of an inspection and found that the steering box is leaking. And that makes sense because when we drove the truck in here, steering was a little loose. Not only is that going to cause a problem with steering, but it'll also cause you to wear out your tires unevenly.